In this lesson, we are going to build an ostinato groove in the Spectrum synth from a single sampled piano note. I've already loaded a sample into the sample editor. Now let's set up the Spectrum synth. We want two measures, and we want 16 beats or events per measure, and we go ahead and click Auto Build. That gives us a Spectrum sequence with events that recreate the piano note's harmonics. The interpolation mode is slow by default, which gives a smooth transition between the notes, but we want an attack for each note, and we want a faster tempo. So let's go ahead and enter 480. Now let's go ahead and shuffle the events using the randomizer die to create some rhythmic interest. Okay, there we have our basic groove. Now let's create a little bit of harmonic interest. Formant envelopes let you filter the harmonics of a spectrum event with the harmonic envelope of another sound using this pop-up menu. Let's apply different formant envelopes to different events. I click under an event and apply an envelope. In this case, we're using formants derived from the human voice, and you can create your own formant envelopes. By holding down the shift key, I can select discontiguous events. Another tool for creating textural interest is the filter brush. Click on it to make it active and choose a brush size. I'm going to use a smallish brush in order to have fine control over the changes I make. Now, anywhere that I click or click and drag, the harmonics will be emphasized. If I hold down the Option key and click or click and drag, I will be de-emphasizing the harmonics underneath the brush. If I hold down the Shift key, it will apply the operation to all the events in the sequence. Let's go ahead and start the sequence playing. I'm going to hold down the shift key and the option key and click on selected harmonics in order to make the sequence less dense so that our changes will be more dramatic. Now I'm going to shift click on this low harmonic to emphasize the pulse and shift click on a slightly higher harmonic. Now I'm going to use the filter brush to stagger the accent between these two harmonics. This should create some rhythmic interest. And here's the final result.